Do I think Spencer is better than JB? Definitely no. By no means I would think that Spencer is better than JB. They share similar abilities such as the 30% accuracy when shooting. But aside from that I wouldn't bet my life on Spencer to keep me alive. What Spencer has that JB doesn't, is the constant mobility when he has distance away from enemies. But that's the issue, why are there limitations, since all these other operators are disposable, meaning they die extremely faster than any other operators. So then in that case, why are their abilities limited? Funny thing about his mobility slow down, I notice that sometimes when Spencer slows down it lets you know that there is an operator nearby, and maybe even Sharon hiding nearby. I think if Spencer's mobility was a constant ability then he would have a lot more of an appeal to wider audience. His accuracy is definitely there, as I played F8 with Spencer and I constantly hit my target. I would assume his accuracy on paper is similar to the one he performs. I wouldn't be able to say the same about his health, as I mentioned before, these other operators are basically disposable and extremely easy to die no matter how much health they possess. Compared to these other operators, Spencer seems to run extremely fast as we contested against Snek and Victor. But honestly Victor is on another planet with his reload speed. Snek, being one of the fastest in normal mobility, comes in a second later than Spencer. Not a big difference, but definitely feels different. One other attribute that this guy possesses in JB Kant is the ability to throw barbed wire with 100% reload speed. The 100% reload speed still takes about 4 to 5 seconds wait time before you are allowed to drop another wire. The upgrade to the barred wire is a great addition for Spencer but I question if it's better to have 100% reload speed or rather have a little more damage from the barbed wire. The wire seems to be on its own trend doing its own thing and you might find it useful now and then. Just like with the Doom Inject, the barbed wire can also be defeated by adrenaline. It also makes the wire difficult to use when operators are flying in the air, and then you are holding wire that might end up killing your own allies on the ground. Two things that I wish Spencer had. First, I wish he had his movement abilities as constant, and not limited to when he is away from enemies. Second, I would hope he would have more bleeding damage from the barbed wire as an option for his sixth talent. I don't recommend or not recommend Spencer, I just felt on some alternate universe, playing him would be a lot better. I wish they take away the limitations and improve some other attributes, but nevertheless, let me know how many of you guys are playing him, as well as what guns and loadouts works best for you. I also tried Capitz and AR with him, he does better with the AR, but struggled against players with longer range guns. Big shout out to the channel's members keeping me alive. Thank you for the love, I do appreciate it a lot. Lastly, YouTube's algorithm is horrendous. One second the videos are traveling fast like Spencer, and then it slows down out of nowhere. Help break the rhythm by liking, subscribing, sharing, and even commenting your thought. I enjoy reading the comments more than anything. I hope you all enjoy the rest of the video and have a great rest of your day.
Boy, I'm a drip.